This is Pancake Engine A, a very small display with two Fresnel lenses stacked on top of it. It uses a small round display which is less than 2 inches. It works with Blue Wise Coco board which has HDMI input and micro USB for power. When you remove the Fresnel lenses you can see how tiny it really is. In this video I will show you how you can make one. So I've started by grabbing this MIPI display from AliExpress. It's a super small, round display, similar to those used in smartwatches. You can get one of these for about 60 bucks. It comes with blue wise cocoa board, which has HDMI port and micro USB for power. The display itself has pretty low resolution, but it's super cheap, which makes it perfect for this kind of project. I've also got two round lenses. Those are 80mm in diameter and 40mm in focal length. Both of them are of course Fresnel lenses. I will also use a couple of self-tapping screws for all of the plastic parts. So first I will assemble the electronics housing. I've printed everything on my Bamboo Lab printer. The MIPI adapter simply slides inside the plastic part. It should easily go inside without any force necessary. And now I will install the lid. It goes directly over the electronics housing. It uses three self-tapping screws to secure everything together. It should now look more or less like this. With the lid installed, you can now install the display holder. The display should easily fit inside the plastic part. If it feels too tight, stop the assembly immediately and reprint this part, otherwise your display will break. And now you can install the display cover. It's this big round piece. It goes directly on top of the display. Use three self-tapping screws to attach it together. And now the assembly is almost ready. The only thing left to do is install the Fresnel lenses. But first let's see if it works. I've connected the display to my PC and as you can see it still is working perfectly fine. So now it's time to install the Fresnel lenses. For this you will need the second large round plastic part. To install the lenses you simply push them inside this plastic ring. And just like that the magnifier is now ready. The magnifier goes directly on top of the display. You can glue both pieces together if you feel like it. I will need the lenses in my other project so I'm not going to glue them. And now the pancake engine is fully operational. You should now be able to easily see the displayed image with your naked eye. It's pretty low resolution, but the image is absolutely huge. So that's pretty much all for today. Thanks for watching everyone and hope to see you in the next video. And as always, huge thanks to my patrons. See you later and goodbye.